everyone, Karen Roby here with Hank Adams. He is the founder and CEO of Rise Gardens. Good to be uh, with you here today, Hank. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Uh, we're talking CES 2021, of course, and you guys are, are new to the mix. Unfortunately, not participating in the way we wish we all could together in Vegas, but, you know, virtually we're doing the best we can here. And this is really interesting. I was excited to see the press release on your all's uh, you know, product there and what you're doing, uh, you're talking about indoor gardening and certainly not, you know, uh, anything we've been used to in the past, how high tech this is. Tell us what you've got there. Sure. Um, so we have two gardens here behind me. One is our, what we call our family rise garden, um, which is actually a modular system. So you're seeing a three level uh, garden, but it's possible to buy it as a single level or a double uh, as well as the triple. Uh, and then we have our personal rise garden off to my other side here, which is a, a smaller version um, intended to, you know, fit everybody's uh, budgets or countertop space, as, as the case may be. Excellent. And, you know, it's funny because uh, it seems in the last maybe two years, the, the amount of people that have, you know, indoor plants is just through the roof, you know, and the, the interest in, in growing inside our, our homes, maybe it's because this year we've all been indoors. I don't know, but it's really great to see all that greenery in, in homes. Yeah, it really is. And, and I, you know, the trend, especially for indoor plants preceded, you know, the current pandemic, uh, but the pandemic has certainly accelerated it. Uh, you know, we did launch this year, but Immediately in the spring, our sales just shot up. And then, you know, this holiday season, even though we had a good year, we doubled yet again. So we've seen really strong demand. And I think it's, you know, it's driven by two things. One is we're all stuck inside. We're all tired of streaming, you know, and binge watching TV or, or being on our devices. And, and, you know, those of us who are parents, as I am, you know, we're looking for something to do with our kids that's not, you know, on a screen. Um, and this is really great. It's it's you know you get to you know nurture something. It it's it's a beautiful system, but the plants are gorgeous. And and it's so you know there that's one trend. The other trend I think is people want access to great you know nutrient dense food, and this provides it in spades. So I think people you know who like to cook or like you know great fresh food for their family, you know have found their way to these products. Yeah, and, and that's great. And the idea of, of, you know, of nurturing, you know, something and like you said, with kids, that's just a, a, a great thing to do, because let's face it, we all have been binge watching a whole lot this last uh, nine months, pretty much. So Hank, let's talk a little bit about the tech behind the tech here. What's involved? I know Wi Fi enabled, there's IoT, take us through a little bit of that. Sure. So it is at its core, a hydroponic system, which means no soil, it's all circulating water. Uh, we do have little pods that, you know, we, we send people and they'll put these little peat moss pods sort of in a cup and then they put that in the garden. Uh, you, you know, when we send it to you, 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 some basic assembly is required, but then you add water, you put your plants in, um, if you enter it, what you planted in your app, we do the rest. Like we'll tell you when you add, need to add nutrients, we'll tell you when you need to, to trim or prune the plants, when they're ready for harvest, et cetera. Um, you already mentioned it is an IoT system, so there's uh, some smarts on board. It's it connects to your Wi-Fi, uh, and so it'll send you alerts as well if you need to add water or do whatever. Um, so you know there is a lot of technology. We custom manufactured the lights, so they're a nice warm you know white light, but they're really optimized for uh, the plants to grow in you know at their at their optimal uh, speed. So yeah, there's a lot of tech built in, and we just launched uh, announced that we're gonna. Uh, integrate with Alexa, Amazon Alexa as well. Very cool. So, so what you're saying is, if I'm understanding you correct, for people like me that have zero luck when it comes to keeping things alive and growing in my home, you guys make it a lot easier for us. We, we do. We do. In fact, and I'm a, you know, gardener and, and an avid gardener for many years. Um, so for me, it, the fun part is experimenting with different plants. And, you know, one of the unique parts of our system is we have adaptations, we built it as a platform. So you could swap out the trays and swap out some components. You know, we'll sell you, um, you know, these plant stands, which lets you grow, you know, the really big, robust kales and shards and peppers and tomato plants. Um, we'll also let you do things like, uh, you know, vining crops, we have trellises that you can add to the system, you can grow rooted vegetables, even a microgreen adaptation coming soon. 
So for me, you know, I love it because I get to experiment with all these things. But for somebody, you know, who's not experienced it with gardening, you really, it's kind of dummy proof. You don't really have to know a lot about it and we'll get you going. And it's sort of fun to explore and try and learn new stuff about gardening. I love it. Dummy proof. That is what I need for, for gardening. For somebody <laughs> who's just starting out, if you're not a green thumb, that's okay. Uh, this will help get people there. Well, I, uh, Hank, I, I certainly appreciate you being with me today. And uh, I, I hope next year for CES, you're able to show off your stuff in person. Yes, we would love to do that. It really does show off well in person because, you know, there's, there's nothing better than plants to, uh, to get people's attention. In, yeah. a, in a busy electronic showroom, right? <laughs> right. Well, a little bit of green goes a long way. Uh, yeah. Hank, thanks for being with me here today. And uh, for all of you, thanks for joining us. For much more, make sure you stick with Tech Republic and BDNet. Thanks for watching.